Hydrogen-powered cars are a promising technology that some believe offers significant advantages over traditional electric vehicles (EVs). They operate using fuel cells that convert hydrogen into electricity, emitting only water vapor as a byproduct. Unlike EVs that store electricity in batteries, hydrogen cars use a fuel cell. This cell mixes stored hydrogen with oxygen from the air, generating electricity to power the motor and resulting in water as the only emission. This setup provides efficiency and a range similar to combustion engines with a quick refueling time, around 5 minutes, potentially advantageous over EVs, which can take hours to charge. While the process of generating and storing hydrogen is less efficient than directly using electricity from batteries, it offers a cleaner energy cycle. However, energy efficiency remains a debate. Hydrogen production, especially through water electrolysis, requires significant energy. Compared to EVs that draw directly from the grid to charge their batteries, hydrogen's production cycle may waste more energy, making it less advantageous in terms of pure efficiency. Both EVs and hydrogen cars aim to reduce carbon footprints. EVs rely on lithium batteries, which are polluting in production and disposal. In contrast, hydrogen can be produced from renewable sources like solar or wind-powered electrolysis, making it a zero-emission option. However, most hydrogen currently comes from natural gas, producing significant carbon emissions. Green hydrogen, derived from clean sources, is a promising solution but remains costly and limited in production. Hydrogen fuel cell technology is costly to produce on a large scale. Hydrogen cars, such as the Toyota Mirai, are priced high, which represents a barrier for many consumers. Additionally, hydrogen production and distribution costs are higher than electricity, particularly in areas without refueling infrastructure. EVs, on the other hand, have seen a steady price decline due to increased lithium battery production, while hydrogen still faces high development and deployment costs. The auto industry is divided on hydrogen vehicles' future. Some automakers, like Toyota and Hyundai, continue investing in hydrogen technology, believing it to be a long-term solution, particularly for heavy and public transport, where hydrogen has advantages in efficiency and load capacity. However, others focus solely on EVs due to rapid infrastructure advancement and growing demand for battery-powered vehicles. The development of green hydrogen sources and reduced production costs are crucial for hydrogen cars to become a viable, competitive alternative. On the other hand, the EV sector is growing rapidly, with advances in battery technologies, such as solid-state batteries, further enhancing EV competitiveness. What do you think? Drop your comments below, hit the like button if you enjoyed this, and don't forget to subscribe for more updates on the world of automobiles. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.